Welcome back, everyone. Because of the rain and the cloud cover, temperatures today a lot cooler. We're going to start off with a little bit of fog in the morning hours and just because of the moisture that's in the ground. So we're going to have some low-level clouds starting off on you know, Wednesday. Then we're going to see some sunshine by the afternoon. Plenty of sunshine as we make our way toward the end of the week, but it's going to be hot and humid for your Thursday and Friday and into the weekend. Then we have storm chances as another cold front comes through, so the rain will be back. But high temperatures temperature today, everybody below normal 80 degrees, the high in Hattiesburg and also in Laurel 81 in Jackson where there was a little bit of rain, uh, but just 85 degrees, a little bit warmer in Meridian with just a few passing clouds. But our dew points right now in the 70s. It's very steamy out there, very sticky, and we're going to see sticky air remain for tomorrow. But that wave of energy that moved through continues to move away from our area. So I think the rain will be ending tonight, as you can see right there, moving along the northern Gulf of Mexico. But overall, it looks like uh, the rain will stop tonight. Anything that develops tomorrow will continue to move off to the east. I think the best chances of rain will be just to our south along the coastal regions. There could be uh, some cloud cover, though, and that will keep those temperatures in the low 90s. But overall, we are going to see above normal temperatures return along with the humidity. So our future radar is showing as we make our way to the overnight, all that rain will be moving out as we start off the day tomorrow. It looks like clear conditions. There could be a stray shower or two uh, early morning hours, but overall, Again, I think we're going to stay dry, maybe just a little bit of clouds just because those uh, the rain will be a little bit closer to our area. But overall, we are going to start uh, warming up for tomorrow and then get even warmer as we head toward the end of the week. So our forecast for tonight calls for temperatures dropping down to around 67 degrees in Hattiesburg, 65 degrees in Sanford, roads around 68 degrees. Any rain that we have out there will be ending. And then some fog will be developing, and that's what we're going to start off with on your Wednesday. Partly sunny skies, decreasing clouds through the day. Temperatures warm around 92 degrees in the afternoon in Hattiesburg, 90 in Sanford, 91 in Columbia, 91 degrees in Purvis. So temperatures just a little bit above normal. And then from there, we warm up to around 95 degrees for your Thursday with plenty of sunshine. Then another system comes through. We're going to stay warm, though, as we head toward the end of the week and into the weekend. So we do have thunderstorm chances, especially on Saturday and Sunday. And then more chances of rain as we head into early next week and temperatures will start to cool down as well. So by Tuesday, we're looking at highs only around 90 degrees with continuing rain chances. But again, the humidity has come back in full force and it's still sticky out there by tomorrow though. Those temperatures, even though it looks like it's going to be 92 degrees, it's going to feel much warmer than that, mm. maybe even close to 100 degrees Whew. out there just because of the high humidity. That's hot. That's very hot. Yes. Hot with two T's. Sticky. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Kim.